on today's episode of Moto Cheese. The following movie is rated I. Look what we have here. A thermal imaging camera by K. Wheats. The KTI W01. Inside the box, a nice thick user's manual. It is multilingual, so this section here is in English. 28 pages. Then we have our wall charger. And a nice case. Very nice case. On the side here, you have your charging port and your data port to pull your images and videos off. Let's flip the protective cover. Ooh, look how hot that roof is. And it's cool out today. We'll go through the settings. We'll have to change this to Fahrenheit. Yeah, look outside. So let's get into the menu. Image correction, enter. Then you have photos, enter. Check or delete all. And this goes back. Then you have videos, check or delete all. Color palette. You know, you have different spectrums. Spectrum, iron, cool, white, and black. Do spectrum. Emissivity. Matte, semi matte, semi gloss, glossy, or customize. And then you have settings. Auto shutdown. Five minutes. Brightness control. You can turn that up a little more. language units I want Fahrenheit temperature image we'll leave it at that there's two different levels so we'll leave it at the lower level time format we'll leave it at 24 hour set time So we set the time, spot, spot is on, we'll leave that on. And then we have version, which is 1.4.1, and that is it. So let's see if this records with all the data on the screen. Others I've tested did not. So we're gonna squeeze and hold the trigger. Start recording, yes. So we're recording as you can see down the bottom. And then I'm gonna squeeze the trigger again. I'm gonna hold the trigger down and recording. Now we're gonna go in, see what they look like. Roof's 105, that's why you need insulation. Nice, all the data's on a screen, playing back. Now let's see if it does it on a computer. Then of course to power it off, hold the power button. Of 
Close your lens cap. Yeah, this is nice. Feels good in hand. Very nice work. Screen seems pretty clear. It was the chair. Yes, the chair. So this comes with software that's built into the memory. So when you plug it into the computer, you can install it. That's another nice feature to have. Here's an emissivity chart for different materials because different substances emit heat differently. This is how to read the display showing where the central point of temperature is. Your current emissivity, emissivity, that's a tongue twister. Your temperature range, your battery power, your color code, temperature cursor at the center point, lowest temperature cursor, the time, and minimum maximum temperature. Lens focal length is 3.2 millimeters. Accuracy is plus or minus 2 Celsius on the high range and plus or minus 4 Celsius on the low range. Infrared resolution is 256 by 192. Visible light resolution is 640 by 480. It has a 3.2 inch display. Built in 32 gig memory. It records in JPEG and MP4 has a 3500 milliamp hour battery which has a six to eight hour working time this weighs 416 grams which is 0.917 pounds somebody mentioned to point it at the moon maybe at night not getting nothing Do video at a garage. Been soaking in the sun most of the day. It is a cooler day today. Let's plug it in and see what it does on the computer. Install this program. When I scan it, there's no threats found, so we will install it. Probably because it's an EXE file, it was a little nervous. We'll take both of these, transfer them into here. It looks like the videos don't work in this program, just images. Let's see if the data transferred to the videos already. Here's some of the videos I took. Well, let's try tonight. It's nice that it transferred all the data with the video. So I'll put up a few videos and photos that I took. Let's see what kind of heat this power supply is giving off. And if the battery is heating up at all while charging. Here's a thermal photo of my dad and my mom. Do video at a garage. Been soaking in the sun most of the day. It is a cooler day today. Here's a thermal image of Gizmo laying in the sand outside. It was a pretty hot day this day. Here's a thermal image of a lizard that Gizmo caught. Don't worry, he just plays with him. He tries not to hurt him anyway. This is a thermal image of my garage. 85 degree day outside. These are those high bay UFO high intensity lights that I put up. They give off a little heat. Here's a video. It's pitch black out. <laughs> huh. 
It's almost into like night vision. Of course, you can change the palette, but yeah, you, I mean, by eye, you can't see that Jeep. And the moon is up there. Pretty cool little unit. And of course for charging, just plug it into your favorite USB wall charger. We'll let it charge up. That will disappear, but it is charging. Looks like this case will nicely fit the user's manual. It's a little tight. Charger and the cord. That's a sweet little package right there. That's what she said. So if you're interested, I have the links down below and whatever discounts these guys give me for you guys. And thanks for watching as always. That's right. Hey, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. We'd love to hear what you have to say. Hit that bell if you want new notifications on new videos. Links for products used are in the description and on motoshees.com. Thanks for watching.